Elon Musk is the authentic Iron Man and the brains behind Tesla, SpaceX, The Boring Company, and PayPal. He has been known for working 20 hours a day, 7 days a week, and has publicly acknowledged sleeping on the Tesla conference room table in order to cram in a few extra hours of work. Musk is worth $170.3 billion at the time of the making of this video and has been very open about his daily schedule. Start applying some of Elon's methodologies and you might find your own journey to becoming one of the wealthiest people on the world. Time to start taking notes. We have the rundown for you right here, from what his mornings look like, to his working hours, to even his pastimes. This is one video you don't want to miss, so be sure to stick around to the end. But before we begin, welcome to Ultimate Luxury. If you like this type of content, be sure to subscribe to the channel, like, comment, and hit the notification bell so you can stay up to date on future videos. Now, let's get into the good stuff. Elon Musk makes sure to get 6 to 6 and a half hours of sleep every night because his day begins at 7 in the morning. Through some trial and error, he discovered that this is the ideal amount of sleep for him. He was quoted in a Reddit AMA as saying, Sleep is really great. If I find if I don't get enough sleep, I'm quite grumpy. I could drop below a certain threshold of sleep and although I would be awake more hours, I would get less done because my mental actuity would be affected. Elon will perform what he perceives as his most essential daily ritual, a shower, after getting up and moving. He finds that skipping breakfast will save him some time in the morning. But this is not always the situation. When he does chow down, he makes sure it's a protein-rich food like an omelet and he'll have it with a cup of coffee. You read that right. One of the wealthiest men on the planet has a regular habit that involves taking a shower. He contends that his best inspiration comes to him while he's rinsing off and believe it or not, there's some scientific evidence to support this. The best way for your brain to come up with an answer to a dilemma According to Shelley H. Carson, a researcher and psychologist at Harvard University and the author of the book Your Creative Brain about unleashing your creativity and productivity, is to take a short break from it. She continues, If you focus on whatever problem is in front of you for too long, you won't be able to come up with a solution. You may establish ingrained prejudices which will keep you thinking in the same unproductive way. A simple task like taking a bath and soaping up your hair can activate new parts of the brain, which in turn can encourage individual liberty in your mind. Before long, you'll be more inventive, fruitful, and imaginative than you were when you were a sweaty, stench-filled mess. To think that Elon discovered this on his own. What a guy. Physical exercise is another morning ritual for Mr. Musk that is a little more on the rare side but does occur. Although we do want to highlight that. When he appeared on the Joe Rogan podcast, he openly admitted to Rogan, I wouldn't exercise at all if I could. Sounds like he's not much of an aficionado, but he does indeed get out and about. In addition to lifting weights, running, and participating in Taekwondo, Karate, Judo, and Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, Elon Musk also appears to enjoy dancing, as demonstrated by some of his, shall we say, distinctive dance moves that he has shown off at the Tesla celebration. Closing out his morning, Elon will see his kids off to school and then drive over to their Tesla or SpaceX, usually in his Tesla Model X, a 79,990 car. Moving on to this billionaire's mid-afternoon, we discover that he divides his time among both his two largest businesses, SpaceX and Tesla. With Tesla mildly outnumbering SpaceX in terms of hours spent work per week, 42 versus 40. And when he's at work, you can guess he's granting it his full attention. During afternoon conferences, Musk frequently eats his lunch quickly because, as he admitted, he is not as conscious about his diet as he should be. Speaking of meetings, Musk claims to detest them, and we can't really blame him. He has his time in the office flawlessly planned out, and consultations just get in the direction of all the great stuff like the engineering of his cars, ensuring that they look and feel flawless, and ensuring that his assembly plans are working as efficiently as possible. Big meetings are prohibited unless they are completely essential. Regular meetings are also prohibited and are only permitted if a matter is pressing, 
and anyone and everyone is free to leave a meeting at any time as soon as they realize it isn't required, according to the rules that Musk has sent out to his employees. Finally, there's a restriction on abbreviations or nonsense words for things, software, or procedures at Tesla because Musk doesn't want anyone wasting their time on formalities. The idea behind this is that anyone should be able to communicate with anyone else in any division and details shouldn't be stalled because one department uses terminology that another is unfamiliar with. Elon Musk claims to put in 120 hours of work per week, but boy does it pay off. On average, he makes $383 million per day. Do you think we're not working hard enough? Elon has acknowledged that he works excessive hours, saying, there were times when I didn't leave the factory for 3 or 4 days, days when I didn't go outside. This has really come at the expense of seeing my kids and seeing friends. He has recently loosened up, working 80 to 90 hours more frequently. But he also stated that this reduction in hours is only momentary. Elon will head home to his 400 square foot prepackaged and collapsible $50,000 boxable casita home which can be pulled by a Tesla Model X luxury SUV as part of his evening schedule. He tweeted to confirm this, writing, My primary home is literally a $50,000 house in Boca Chica Starbase that I rent from SpaceX. Once back home, he'll make sure to eat a substantial dinner. While this may not be the healthiest way to gain weight, it often works for Elon. His favorite foods include French food, barbecue, and Diet Coke. He also occasionally enjoys a whiskey or a glass of wine. Elon spends time at home with his girlfriend who is worth $3 million and their young child. He also watches some of his preferred television programs such as Silicon Valley and Black Mirror. But he also admitted he enjoys anime, particularly Death Note. He enjoys playing video games a lot with one of his favorites being Cyberpunk 2077 which earned $563 million in total sales revenue. However, he also stated on Twitter that only one console game, Halo, has truly captured his heart. Apparently, Elon reads two books a day, listens to podcasts and audiobooks, and throws in frequent celebrations. We're not sure how big of a party he'll be capable of throwing in his 400 square foot home, but we don't think that will limit him from throwing one. He once leased a palace in England where the invitees got to play hide and seek. If that's not a place to spend your 30th celebration, we don't know what is. It's lights out at 1am for Mr. Musk and he, re and he repeats the process the following day. There's no need to force oneself to be like Elon. This man is truly exceptional. His IQ has been estimated to be as high as 155. To put that in context. The average individual has an IQ of 100, and the median in the United States is 98. Only a very tiny proportion of people have an IQ of 130 or higher. Yes, the man is extremely intelligent, but as Musk said on Joe Rogers' podcast, it would be stressful for others to be in his position. Nevertheless, given that Musk is currently worth $170.3 billion, we believe it is worthwhile. He sure knows how to live the billionaire luxury lifestyle. Before we part ways, we want to leave you with another billionaire's habit that will leave you perplexed. It appears that being a multi-billionaire doesn't require you to live like one. Ingvar Kamprad, the former CEO of IKEA who passed away in 2018, was worth $42.5 billion and was known to drive a 22,000 15-year-old Volvo, fly budget airlines, and eat at regular restaurants. That's pretty wild, huh? If you want to know more about how multi-billionaires live the luxury lifestyle, leave a comment below and be sure to subscribe to Ultimate Luxury for more content like this. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.